It's not your imagination No, you're not black American You wonder why they call you Jamaican When you were above all the other nations It's not your imagination No, you're not a Haitian You wonder why they call you Puerto Rican When you were above all the other nations It's not your imagination they just wanna keep us down They don't wanna see us with the crown You don't want it, then the gates, they're of language They are black into the ground, yeah They keep us low-key, red daddy no see It's more to you than them dreads and them gold teeth I never cut my beard, forget a gold teeth God just spirit like a gold Check, check, check. Welcome to Four Corners News, where the, the truth, truth speaks. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. We back. And we back, baby. I'm Captain Zakar to my left. Captain Severus. To my right. Officer Tobias. To my far left. Officer Azaniah. And to my hey. far right. Officer Lyle. Oh, hey, hey, tight his, tight hey, him up, man. Now. Y'all gave him the blurry Get face that. and stuff, man. <laughs> He man. married anyway. Come on now, right. dog. Hey, welcome to Four Corners news. news, man. Glad to be back here Woo. Thursday. Prime time, baby. We had a hiatus no, Rick, here, a few high holy days and things of that nature. That's right. But all praise to the most high. We back with a jam-packed show for you. Make sure you're sharing this with your mom and them. That's right. Yep. <laughs> mom so and can, them. So they can wake up to what's going on out here in this world. Realize that uh, we're in the last days. That's right. Get to it, man. Now... Um, all of us have been keeping up with uh, Ahmad Albury, yeah, right? Yeah. We've been seeing what's going on with him. Now, this is why. Let me tell y'all this. Make sure, I, make sure you can understand the words that are coming out of my mouth. Bring it out. This is why the Bible calls the white man the devil. The topics, the that we are, the articles we're about to bring out, is is exactly why. The white man is called the devil in the Bible. Bring it out. Prove it. You heard him right. He ain't stutter. Let's pull up. Let's pull up the article. We ain't even gonna look at the videos. We're just gonna read what it says about the brother Ahmad Aubrey, our brother, an Israelite that was gunned down. Mm. See what they doing to the young man's name. The brother dead. Yeah. He can't even defend himself. Right. That's crazy. Look what they doing to him. Can you read that for us, officer? Ahmaud Arbery. Cops got aggressive in 2017. Tried tasing him while hands were up. Now, Amazing. Just, just scroll down a little bit, and you can see the image. Now, look. Look at this. Mm. Now, what do they say? Like a, um, a picture speaks a thousand, thousand words, words, right? Yeah. All of a sudden, you know, you got, you got two good Christian white folk. Yeah. On I mean, trial right, right now, right, arrested for right. murder. All of a sudden, here comes all of these videos of Ahmad Arbery looking like a you know what. Yeah. Out of the, the woodwork. Out, out of nowhere. What is the white man trying to do? He is trying to slander the brother's image right, to justify the killing. Of another black man in America. Bring it out! I'm telling you, and that's the mo. Every time uh, you have this, something like this happen, that, that's the number one thing. Yep. Pull up his records, go through his history. Let's see the the, the dirt that we can have on him, yeah. right. so people uh, 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 can feel bad and justify the killing. Yep. It was a exactly. murder, murder. You can't clean that up. Nah. This, uh, this is just something. basically to reinforce the fact that you are three-fifths of a man in mm -hmm. America. That's it. That your life your, don't your, matter. Your life deserves to be... If we kill you, your life deserves to be taken anyway. Right. Right. Even if even if we was uh, in the wrong, your life deserves to be taken anyway. Look at you. Look at how you look. And then they paint the image you of you being a niggard. Mm. Pull right. it up again, man. Pull up at Because automatically when you see that, you're going to think the worst of yeah, him of as a person. Yeah. Pants sagging, head on, no, no shirt, shirt on. on. You automatically think, oh, he's nigga. Right, you write right. him off. Go to the next one. Go to the next one. Read that for us, officer. Newly released Ahmaud Arbery 
Video shows 2017 shoplifting arrest. Why all of this mm. is coming out of nowhere? Out of nowhere. This, you know what? That first video was released, right? Mm. The very next day, this one was released. Mm. Yeah. The very next day, they simultaneously setting them up. So you're saying this is planned. This is planned. This is a planned attack because the the father was obviously a political man or whatever. Yeah. He couldn't be tried in his area because it would be conflict of interest. Right, right. He knew so, everybody in the court system. Right. He knew everybody. So now... They have to smear his name, smear the brother's name, because what is the best way to get the people off is the trial haven't even started yet. Yeah, yeah. They got to control their minds as to who uh, Ahmaud Arbery is. Mm-hmm. So even before they get into court, they already in their minds. So, you and, and you know this is a, a high-profile case. So Absolutely. what happens is if it goes to a grand jury or whatever, Everybody that's going to come to that jury is going to know or have some kind of knowledge of the case going on. Right. And just think if they catch that glimpse, those they articles. Got it. They of got him, it. They, they poisoned they poison they it already. Yeah. Poison the water yeah. already as soon as you go into it. So, and you know how things go down with that. And these uh, are police videos from the police cameras. Yeah. So somebody done went and got a public uh, records request yeah. and got all the videos that he Possibly was in. I wouldn't be surprised if it wasn't the daggone lawyer of these two white yeah, dudes. Bring it out, yeah. right? Because they know the power of social media, man. Yeah, you gotta understand this white man is who's the devil, the deceiver. He knows the power of this uh, creation called social media. Yeah. So he's gonna go ahead and poison the mind of the people. So, like you said, Cap, when they go on to the jury, they might already fi- fix. And, he already and, had multiple run-ins. And, mm-hmm. and what do you need when it comes to jury to get off? It's like a... Uh, Probable cause, right? What, no, no. Like one person one or person one or two yeah, people. Yeah. It's, it's, um, What's it called, Becker? Hung no, jury. Hung jury, that's right. Hung jury. You get a, somebody that has... Uh, uh, it's like doubt or something. Yeah. What's the term, YouTube, Facebook? It's blocked. It's a blocked uh, jury, basically. It's a term, though, reasonable for, for doubt. reasonable, reasonable doubt. doubt. Mm-hmm. If that one person gives that, him reasonable doubt, it'd be like a hung there jury, you and then, you know what? They can't let him go scot-free where uh, they'd be like, not guilty because they know black people are going to riot. Mm-hmm. Right. So they're not going to do that. What do they do? They'll give him a year, two years yeah. in jail. Yep. Uh, they'll be like manslaughter mm-hmm. or something else. They'll trump up some other cases to try to appease people so they don't riot like back in what uh what was that Rodney King Rodney days King mm-hmm. yep. they 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 riot when that stuff came up, came across um go to Psalms I got a script for that go mm-hmm. to Psalms 50 and uh give me verse 19 19 and 20 now we got we prove it to you. the Bible says that the Caucasian man all over the earth mm. cuz they don't just do that here in America. I'm pretty sure they probably do it in Russia, they're going Germany, oh, wherever they they can trump up and pull up dirt to slander uh one of our people's names. They do it yep. for their benefit. Absolutely. Read that verse 19 and 20. Psalms chapter 50 and verse 19. Uh-huh. Bring it out. Thou givest thy mouth to evil, and thy tongue frameth deceit. Now thy tongue frameth lies. Now you got the head honcho of liars that is ruling the country right now. Right. <laughs> I, I can't even, I, I don't even know where it is. If somebody could throw out the number, maybe you know you know on YouTube, Facebook. They say Trump has lied at least. I, I don't, I want to say it's in the double digit thousands, but it might be like two, three thousand times. Right. right. The hell he is this? literally lied in front of the camera. Hey, I'm not going to let you talk bad about Trump, man. <laughs> you like Trump? Man, I'm going to tell you man. straight up. Uh, I'm, 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 we betting on Trump right now that he might be the one. <laughs> the that usher. The Lord, there you go. So I'm not gonna stand by and let you bad mouth this man. He might be the one to, to, to usher in. There you go. To help usher in the yes. kingdom. Uh, right. Yes. Yes. He might be of, the one. I lay off of Trump. Y'all watch out for Cap Severus. Yeah, might, man. He <laughs> might be melanin in his ballot. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all ain't, catch, y'all ain't see me at no polls. <laughs> oh, no polls. Yeah, mailed it in. Give hey, read verse years, 19 y'all. again. Verse 19, thou givest thy mouth to evil, and thy tongue frameth deceit. Thou tongue frameth deceit. Read on. Thou sittest and speakest against thy brother. Now, they, they speak against that. Don't they say that, that we, we all one in Christ yeah, Jesus? Right. We yeah. Christian you know brothers, brothers, right? One God, one love oh, for all. Oh, man. Oh, man. It says you sit and you speak against thy brother. But how does he speak against his brother? Read on. Thou slanderest thine own mother's son. Thou slanderest. 
thine own mother's son. Ooh, that's a cool precept. Pull that, the pull them this? articles, uh, uh, videos out the woodwork. You don't normally, you don't do that stuff. You gotta and scrape for that information. You gotta, you gotta look for go, that You gotta dig. You gotta know somebody that knows know somebody, somebody that knows that's somebody. gonna push that uh, uh, request to the front where you can get it out. One come out one day, and then the next will come out the next day after that. You gotta know somebody to do that. And you know what that shows you? That shows you the power that all Esau, they mind is unified. Bring it out. They're unified with the media. I mean, yeah. with the media, they got connects with the media, and the media push out the narrative that they want them to have. Yeah. yeah. So that way they could trick the mind of our people to think that this is an evil person. That this guy is deserving of what he got. Because, he slandered his brother. Because if you look at it right now, you look at the videos and stuff of him walking in the house, you know, it kind of looks like, it looks odd. Like, you know, why are you stopping in a house, you know, Jogging that can look odd. So that little bit of doubt that that video yep, creates, right. Esau's Absolutely. like, we're gonna we're gonna enforce that there doubt go. and mm. make him look like a real nigger that he is. Right. At the you end remember? of the day, what black person hadn't been stopped by the police? Bring it out, right? Right. Yeah. Walking, just been... walking from the park yep. to home. Hey, where y'all going? What you doing? Yeah. What do you mean? So many videos we can even come on, them all man. Out. Hell, you might even work for, for the police yeah. uh, station and get questioned by Becky. How about sure. that? Damn. Yeah. That happens, that happens that? a lot. And then that's a light thing, too, because even during their campaign, when they're doing a little campaigning, how much slander videos you see oh, yeah. against one another? Yeah. Don't vote for this person because they was caught smoking marijuana. <laughs> Don't vote for that person because uh, they uh, was uh, calling somebody the N-word. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sexual harassment. That's right. called politics. Come on. They do it to themselves. That's called politics. They go yeah. the extra mile for us. Yeah. The extra mile. Can I get a script? Yeah, pull it, man. Oh, go to Revelations real quick. Yeah. Bring it Revelations out. Revelations uh, 12, verse 10. Bring it out. Watch this. Revelations chapter 12. In verse 10. Bring it out. And I heard a loud voice saying in heaven, mm. now is come salvation. Now is come salvation. Come and on. And strength. And the kingdom of our God. Come on. And the power of his Christ. Read. For the accursor of our brethren. Read that right, brother. Read that right. For the accuser. The accuser mm. of who? Of our brethren is cast down. Come on. Which accused them before our God day Woo! and night. How they do, how, they do right it there. day and night. They frame up iniquity yeah. against our brothers day and night. Well, we read in well, Revelation, that time is soon to come. That's right. When they will no longer do that anymore. That's Go right. And, and, and that's heavy. You bring it up. Says, it says, the accuser of our brethren is cast down, which accused them before our God mm. day and night. So you know what that means? They they are literally in their mind. They think God hear them. They are saying, "Look, God, he, look, he's a he's a nigger." There you go. Yeah. Look at him. He's violent. Mm. He was shoplifted from Walmart three years ago. Mm. He he deserves death. Mm. He Man, all all all, it, all but it. but they don't know that when when it comes to us and our God, Daddy said that we can repent and come home. Yeah. Daddy Man. said we can change. Right. Yep. right. What Daddy they said that. Go ahead. What they basically saying is that this is your son, God, and this is what they're doing, and we're justified in killing them. Yep. Meaning they know if they kill the sons of God, what they're doing, they're directly targeting God himself. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Now, look at it. Remember we said that the, the Bible says that he's the devil straight up? Right. He's the accuser, right? Yeah. Read verse 9 wow, okay, to see go, what right. it calls right. The person that accuses us. Mm. Revelation chapter 12 and verse 9. Bring it out. And the great dragon was cast out. Uh -huh. That old serpent. That mm. old serp. That old snake in the grass. Mm. Yeah. That when you ain't looking, he'll bite you. Read on. Called the devil. Call what? Ooh. The devil. Uh huh. And Satan. He's called the devil and, and Satan. Satan. Read on. Man. Which deceiveth the whole world. How did this devil and Satan deceive the whole world? He accused us not before the whole, just before the whole world, but even before God. That no way that them niggas is your people, right. God. Mm. No way they the real Jews. Bring it out. Bring it out. No way that they are Christians. We the Christians and we the Jews now, and them ain't nothing but Gentiles. Mm. Right. Mm. Dang. Them are niggas. It says that he, de he uh, the devil you. and the Satan, and Satan deceived the whole world. Read on. He was cast out into the earth, 
and his angels was cast out with him. It means he was cast down. Mm. Now you jump up to verse 10. It calls him what? Also, the accuser mm. of our brethren. Yeah. Woo. That's heavy. That's why we that's why the Bible says that this man right here mm. is the devil. He's Satan, that right. he's that old snake. Right. That's right. Cap, could I land back off you? Land of, back. Hey, th- go Bring to Psalms. Bring a bit of herbs, too. Give some, <laughs> g- go to Psalms chapter 35 <laughs> and verse 21. <laughs> go to Psalms chapter 35 and verse 21. Psalms chapter 35 and verse 21. Bring it out. Yay. They opened their mouth wide against me. Mm. They opened their wide mouths wide against Ahmad Arbery via yep. their media, right? Yep. Read. And said, aha, aha. Our eye have seen it. Meaning they said, yeah, we got this dude. Yep. We got this nigga. Right? Read. This thou has seen, O Lord. Keep not silence, so, O Lord. So, so King mm, David heavy. is saying, do not be quiet. That's do not be heavy. silent in this. Bring plagues upon his people. Read. Bring it out. Be not far from me. Jump jump up to verse 20. Watch this. Verse 20. For they speak not peace. Meaning when you think mm. they think, when you think they say, oh, we just trying to get a, a, a resolution to this case. We're trying to bring peace to Ahmad's very family. Yeah. We're just trying to bring peace among our community. Justice. There's no su- we're, we're, right. justice. we're searching for justice. We're searching for justice. There's yeah. no such thing as black and white. We are all human. Yeah. Can we help you in your cause? We yeah. help you in your cause. <laughs> Read. But. They devise deceitful matters against them that are quiet in the Ooh, land. But when you look at Ahmad Arbery, he what, what did he do? Oh, he was just jogging. He was just running. Heavy, Bring it out. That's he's a quiet, cold precept. Quiet in the land. We ain't bothering nobody. No. no. Like like a, like we said before that what's that age old saying uh, well, that we live by? Don't start nothing. It won't, won't be, be nothing. Done. Because in the, even in the video, uh, he's he's telling the police, "Yeah, I'm a rapper. So I'm just I'm, he just he a rapper, so he's writing things down in, in the park when in they the trying to tase him." Okay. He said, "He, he said, man, why you messing with me? Right. I only got one day off, there you and go. all I'm right. doing Damn. is chilling in my car, and you come mess with me." There you mm. go. Damn. That's what he said. Damn. I get, I work six days a week. I got one day off. I like that verse twenty one, man. Mm. It said uh, verse twenty two. It says. This thou has seen. Uh, God personally sees God it. sees it. That's the thing that we forget as a people. We think God has forsaken us mm. and forgotten. Yep. God has not forgotten about us. He sees it. But but we we are too uh, much in our wickedness as a nation right, right now right. Bring it out. that he can't dwell amongst us. Enough of us ain't repented yet for God to, to get up off his throne. Right. Once enough of us repent, he'll get up off his throne. And when he come down and set foot, oh. It's game over. Woo. It's He's building a case over. right now. What you say, officer? He building a case oh, right now. Man. So when he come down, like, I remember you did that to my oh, baby. Man. I remember you did this. That's heavy, So man. basically what you're saying is every time another black young man got shot down by the police or by Esau, even in slavery, God is writing that He's down. He's writing hey, all that hey, down. Hey, Building hey, a case. that against them. Uh, officer, you are the spirit. Go to Psalms chapter 9 to show to show that, man. To show that, that he is not. He's building a case and he has not forgotten about us. Um, Let's see. Let's read uh, Psalms chapter 9. Let's read verse 8. We'll get straight to it. Psalms chapter 9 and verse 8. Uh-huh. Bring it out. And he shall judge the world in righteousness. He shall minister judgment to the people in uprightness. Judgment is what? Justice. Read on. The Lord also will be a refuge for the oppressed, Uh a refuge in times of trouble. And they that know thy name will put their trust in thee. For thou, Lord, has not forsaken them that seek thee. God has not forsaken those that seek him. Right? Read verse 12 now. Verse 12. When he maketh inquisition for blood. When he does what? Maketh inquisition for blood. When he looks into the case. When the when the time for the uh, uh, balances to be weighed. What, when justice has to be administered, he asks he ask a question here. He makes inquisition here. Did you do this? Did you do that? What did you do to my people? Hold on. I got tape. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I got tape on you accusing mm. my people for being wicked when you are the king of wickedness. Not me, Lord. Hey, <laughs> Michael, 
Rotate. <laughs> rotate. <laughs> this, this, rotate. Sir, this rotate. Break the witnesses. Me. Let's break all the. Let's break. And you know who the witness is going to be? All the other nations that have sat back and watched how yep. they have treated. Because mm. oh, a lot of the nations, Ooh. when they see how they treat blacks in America, they speak out against America yep. Yep. and condemn them for the way they treat. He's going to bring all the nations on yep. trial. Yep. Uh, uh, Moab, Washpot. You are no. Nah, I don't want you to open your mouth. You you gonna get it. Right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Elon, what did you see them do to to my people? Oh, I see. They abused them. They abused them. They abused them. I see. I see. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but, but Cap, you know what's more heavy about that is is that the witness is gonna be Ahmad Arbery himself. Oh yeah. Where he where God brings Wake up his up. he Wake wakes him up. him up and he shows him what did you do to my uh, what did he do to what you? What did he do to you? Right. Lord, he, he killed me while I was jogging. Mm. Hey, finish out verse 12. When he maketh inquisition for blood, he remembereth them. He remembers who has spilt our blood. Read. Read out. He forgetteth not the cry of the humble. Read that again. He forgetteth not, not the, the cry of the humble. So when God gets ready to administer justice, to balance out the scales, he will make inquisition of the blood of ours that has been spilt mm, mm. in the land of our captivity. Oh, it's going to be a Ooh. sad, sad day for all nations, boy. And you're going to have Ooh. the angels that's standing there. <laughs> it's your ass, <laughs> Mr. Postman. <laughs> the angels going to be standing behind the most high with, I don't know what they're going to have. Yeah. They're going to have a sword, a big old sword, glistening. This sword. With that thing out, just shing. <laughs> That's crazy. Man. Hey, hey, go go to the Man. picture. Go to the picture. Somebody made a a, a meme mm. uh, um, articulating what they are doing with Ahmad Arbery's image, his name as a as a human being, as an Israelite. Pull up the image. Oh man! Read, drop drop the uh, bars for us. Oh, blow it up one of the two. Drop Real the bars. Quick. Like I said, like a, like eating my head. No, drop drop the bars. Drop the bars for him now. Yeah, I, I want to see all of that. Zoom out. Oh, zoom out. Yeah, zoom out on it. Zoom out on it for us. There Damn. we go. There we go. Damn. Read that, officer. Hey, I just shot and killed this kid. Can you find any old videos of him there that I can loosely use to say why he deserved to die? I. Settle for an old tweet. I settle Damn. for an old tweet. Damn, that's wow. crazy. That's slander. Yeah. And whoever drew that, he he peeped it. He picked it up. Mm. Yeah. I just shot and killed this kid. Give me anything to to destroy his name. To to tweet. slander is my own mother's son. Mm. Amazing. Because for for people that that don't understand, Esau is shematic. There you go. There he's is. he's shematic. He's our brother. Yeah, he co he comes down the line no, no. of uh, you would consider him what Hebrew, yeah. right? Yeah, mm -hmm. right. You would consider him he, he slanders his yeah. own brother that he accuses us before our own yeah. God that we ain't deserving of salvation. Yeah, he say he kills his mother's son. Yeah. We got the same mama. Yeah, we yeah. got the same mama. We was in at the same time. Yep, right. fighting. Pull that thing up one more time, man. Cause pictures. Yeah, Read it again, man. Hey, I just shot and killed this kid. Can you find any old videos of him that I can loosely use to say why he deserved to die? I'd settle for an old tweet. Give me that in Malachi, hmm. man. Give me that in Malachi, and I want to read chapter one. You know what I want. Uh, yeah, let's get straight to the point. Let's go to uh, verse four. Malachi chapter one and verse four. Bring it out. Or as Edom saith, we are impoverished. But we will return and build the desolate places. Uh -huh. Thus saith the Lord of hosts. They shall build, but I will throw down. And they shall call them the border of wickedness. The border of wickedness. Now, now you know, a lot of people say, why ain't y'all talking about black on black crime? We talk about that. Yeah, we're we going to talk yeah, about that do. today, yeah, yeah, too. On, we, yeah. we, we, don't, uh, we ain't unrighteous judges. There you go, right. But God says that this dude right here, he's this the beginning and the end Bring it out. of wickedness. That's right. He's the border of wickedness. Read that again, man. Whereas Edom saith, we are impoverished, but we'll return and build the desolate places. Pull, pull, up, the, pull up the picture and let's read the script at the same time, man. Read thus, thus saith the Lord of hosts, they shall build, but I will throw down, and they shall call them the border of wickedness. Uh-huh. 
and the people against whom the, the Lord. The people, not just the person, the people, the whole nation. Read on. The people against whom the Lord have indignation hatred. forever. Hatred for how long? Forever. Forever, ever? Forever, ever. Forever, ever. That's Even right. When they take the lives of, 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 of his precious... Pull your script, uh, Cam, because I got something, man. Um, get, get Second Thessalonians, too, because that's our duty. Before I know, we'll start off uh, blaming black on black crime. We'll get on them because remember, the judgment starts at the house of Israel right. first. Right. But we got to do our job, y'all. Go to Second Thessalonians, two and three. Come on, Second Thessalonians chapter two and verse three. Come Bring it on. out. Let no man deceive you by any means. For that day shall not come, except there come a falling away first. Falling away first, meaning Israel must go into captivity. They must get judged for their wickedness first. Come on. And that man of sin. That man of who? Of sin. What we just saw is the man of sin. Big red target on him. <laughs> Read. And that man of sin. Bring it out. Be revealed. Be what? Be revealed. He must be revealed. Because a lot of our people have been dazzled, been tricked by the uh, stimulus check, yeah, right, the yeah. WIC, yeah. All right, the, the apps that's on their phone. They've been deceived, so they, they can't see the sin. Read. Yep. And the son of perdition. And the son, that means the person who's destined for destruction. That nation is destined for destruction. Yep. Go ahead, Cap. Hey, go to First Chronicles 16. First Chronicles 16, and I want to read verse 13, and then we're gonna we're gonna jump down. First Chronicles 16, First, and let's read verse 13. First Chronicles chapter 16 and verse 13. Uh-huh. Oh, ye seed of Israel, his servant, ye children of Jacob, his chosen ones. Blacks, Hispanics, and Native oh, Indians, man. those of the diaspora, those of the slave trade, of the colonialism. You are the Israelites of the seed of Jacob, the <laughs> chosen ones of God. That's right. That's, right. That's who we are. That's who we That's be. Right. We can't change that because God ordained it before he put us in the womb. Bring it and out. I'll jump down to verse 20. Verse 20. And when they went from nation to nation and from one kingdom to another people, he suffered no man to do them wrong. Yea, he reproved kings for their sakes. Read verse 22. Saying, Touch not mine anointing. Do what? Touch not mine anointing. Yeah, we might be in captivity. We might be kicked out of our homeland. We we might be waiting on our, our, our king, uh, Christ, to come back and Deliver. redeem yeah. us and take us home. But in the meantime, God has commanded all nations mm. to do what? Read verse 22. Saying, touch not my anointing. And that's the Israelites that we are. Read on. And do my prophets no harm. No prophet, no harm. That's you know what that means? You better not lay hands on no black, That's Hispanic, right. or Native Indian on the face of this earth. Those are the prophets of God, the Israelites that That's we are. That's right. Whether we in we we are asleep in our wickedness right. or we are awoke in, in this truth, keeping the commandments, God commanded all nations to That's do right. what? Touch not my anointed, anointed, and do my prophets no harm. Right. And when you do harm to his prophets, you got to pay for that judgment. And mm. it might not be right now. Right. It's going to be on that day when you think. And you know what's the worst part about it is when it comes and then, you know, it is laid out in front of you. The kingdom is behind the Most High. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. glistening. The angels are saying it. Hallelujah. They got big black angels, the beautiful voices. You see all the gold. The sh you can look from a distance, the street paved with gold. And you see the, the nice rubies the, in the wall, the foundations of the wall. And you and Edomite think you're great walking to the kingdom of heaven. Hey! And the Lord says, Walk out that thing. <laughs> 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 Jesus, like Mr. Rogers. <laughs> And, and, and the nice. most high says, Angel, Gabriel, stop that whole nation <laughs> in their tracks. <laughs> and administer judgment. There you go. There you go. Cap, it's funny that you said that just to, you know, land back off you because a lot of people, when they see cases like Ahmad Arbery, mm -hmm. the first thing that they do, they start getting worried and their faith just start to waver. You mind if I land back off you? Yeah, go ahead. Go to Psalm chapter 140 and verse 1. Because this is what God says when you see cases like Ahmad Arbery. Psalms 140 and 1. And verse 1, yeah. Psalms chapter 140 and verse 1. Bring it out. Deliver me, O Lord, from the evil man. Yeah. 
preserve me from the violent man. So stop right there. Pull up the picture again so we could see what this scripture is go. actually talking about. Pull up the picture. You see what it says? It says, hey, I just shot and killed this kid. And what do you see? Uh, this man with a gun and, the, and, and a brother, he's filled with blood. This man lives off of violence, yep. meaning like this, Esau's mindset is just to kill and destroy. He get like his pleasure that he gets from is by killing yeah. and destroying all other nations. Bring but God out. says for us not to worry because why? Read the scripture again. Put, Deliver me, O Lord, from the evil man. So because it's it's a wicked thing to for a man that's running away from you that you take him and that you shoot him in the back. It's a wicked thing that right. when you look at a man, you try to slander him by media, getting popular persuasion and switching yeah. the minds of the people to make you think that you the good guy in the whole situation. That's exactly what that is. Hey, that's every point you bring it out. They trying to they trying to uh, um, sway people's judgment. Uh, New York Times did a, a a whole reconstruction of how they chased him down and, and killed yeah, him. Yeah. Uh, pull up the pull up the video and let's 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 dissect that thing. Pull it up. Why do you think Esau only released thirty seconds? It's a four minute there video. Yeah, he cut it to thirty seconds. Say, yeah. hey, this is what I got. Mm -hmm. Short people, our people have short attention spans, and they know they all they need is thirty seconds or like ten seconds of a clip to get Come the point to a across. Simple judgment. Hey, pull it up. Pull up the video. Yeah, let's play that. Why is this allowed out here? Why? In February, twenty-five-year-old Ahmed Arbery was shot dead in the South Georgia neighborhood of Satilla Shores. In the two months that followed, no arrests were made. But local residents and lawmakers protested what they said was a deadly combination of racial profiling and flawed self-defense laws. When they stop you, make sure you got your cameras on. Pause make it. Sure you got a... Didn't Deacon Yawasab just say that? There you go. He brought it out. Deacon Yawasab yes. said that, that that is a fearful, that is terror. Yes. yes. That you have to, you have to... Make sure you got a car charger so your phone don't go dead right. in case you get pulled over. Yep. Cuomo, That's a people living in terror. Uh, Cuomo, Chris Cuomo was yep. uh, talking to the, the dude with the little bowl cut that took the video. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he said that if you, what do you think, if you did not record it, what do you think that would have happened? Yeah, okay. He might said, I don't think nobody would have known exactly there what happened. You go. Mm -hmm. They wouldn't have never known what happened. That means that they took, they would have took his word and just, you know, it is what it is. Yeah. It is what it is. Yeah. It that was the Lord. It. That was the Lord revealing that thing. Yeah. He planted yeah. that thought. Go ahead. Push. Go ahead and release that. That thought that's on your mind, you might vindicate your friend. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's innocent. Yeah. You <laughs> said they something. Shot. Listen, they get shot all the time. Yeah. Right. Go ahead and do it. They're used to it. Yeah. He's, just, he's just another person, but this guy is a well-decorated, retired veteran. Not not understanding that the Lord said in their affliction, they're going to seek me early. Go yeah. ahead and put that out there and show my people they still afflicted. Right. Somebody's right. going to repent off of it. Bring it out. Go back to the video. Video. Police did eventually arrest two suspects, but it was days after this video of the fatal shooting emerged. Gregory McMichael and his son Travis were charged with murder and aggravated assault. Oh, red! Look at his red ass! The case has reignited the national debate over racial violence. I'm sure you saw the news about Ahmad Arbery. It looks like murder. The American public saw the video. What exactly happened in the last moments of Mr. Arbery's life? Using security camera footage, cell phone video, and 911 calls and logs, the Times has reconstructed the critical 12 minutes from when Mr. Arbery appeared on Satilla Drive to his right. death less than 300 yards away. It's around 1 p.m. on February 23rd when Armored Arbery is out less than two miles from his home. A security camera at 219 Satilla Drive is recording when Mr. Arbery enters the frame at around 1.04 p.m. He may have been jogging in the area, but he stops on the front lawn of 220 Satilla a house being built across the street. Arbery glances around and wanders into the open construction site. Inside, security footage briefly captures him looking around. Yep. Meanwhile, oh, outside, a neighbour walks from Jones Road towards Attila Drive. 
Overalls. You got old. You, you still a white man with overalls? That's it. You you get run. the hell out of town. You gotta run. Dodge. Get out of Dodge. And, and they say, hey, boy, what you going over Dodge. here? The neighbor waits by the street corner. He will later tell the dispatcher that Arbery resembles a recent trespasser in the area. He's been caught on the camera a bunch before at night. Kind of an ongoing he thing don't know here. that. Black guy, white guy. On multiple occasions Look before this. February 23rd, several trespassers were caught wow. on camera at 2.26. Pause it. Stop. Wow. They ain't called the police on them, they though, did the they? Woo. Hey, you know, know. Unbelievable. Hey, that's right. cool. They Damn. called the police on that white family walked in in the middle of the night walking did in that all, house. Right. Did all type of foolishness in there. I bet you. Could have. You, wow. you know how nasty yeah. Esau is. Yeah. 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 They want a thrill. Didn't right. call the police on them, though, did they? They Damn. only called and reported when they seen a black boy yeah, walking in there. Bring it out. That just threw a monkey wrench. That's, 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 that's that slander and that yeah, accusing. Go, he got to be up to no good. Right. This Negro can't be around here looking in no house. Who he think he is? We don't want him in our neighborhood anyway. Even the thought of you trying to, even if you had the money to move in, we're going to put the fear in you. Yep. Right. Damn. Go back to it. Run it back a few seconds, man. Show where them people walking in at. Yep, right there. February 23rd, several trespassers were caught on yep. camera at 2.26. That's night Cilla. vision, y'all. Night vision. The owner vision. routinely alerted the police. On four occasions, what appears to be the same man was filmed. It's unclear if this was Arbery, but even if it were, right, uh, this does no, not right. justify the shooting by Arbery. neighbors That's outside on the cut. street. Yeah, that, that, that the site's cut. owner says nothing was ever stolen from That's the house him. during these incidents. Pause it. Or on February the owner said nothing was ever stolen nothing. from the place. And you looking at those pictures, man, that don't look like somebody that's stealing something. That just, it looked like it was just walking around in circles. Yep. Th that's crazy to me. How do you try to rob a, 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 a house that's trying to be built? What's in there? A uh, uh, towel? Two. You, you, that, that, you, you, sling, you sling a towel? I'm about to go to the <laughs> chop shop where I'm hey, about to try I got to a flip crowbar. some towels. Hey, yo, what's up? I got some towels for you. I got a concrete slab. I got to send the block for you. Right. What the hell? That makes zero sense. Go back to it, man. Let the play. February 23rd, and no property was ever damaged. Mm. But neighbors were aware of the trespasses, and the community was on alert. Now, back to the day in question. They was on it's alert 8 PM, for that and Arbery is walking around that went inside in there. the house. Four minutes after he entered, he walks out and runs off. In the top corner of the security footage, we can see What's down the street to 2.30 Satilla, the home of Travis McMichael. At 1.10 p.m., Travis and his father, Gregory, grab their guns, jump in a white truck, the van and leave there. the house there to pursue going. Mr. Arbery. Wait, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Hold, we hold, don't on. Have hold, footage. On. hold on. Pause. Pause. Go back just a couple seconds. So, 2.19... Satilla Drive calls the police because yep. he came out of 220. How in the hell does 230, which there is McMichael's, know that he just... Came? That's I what, one, two, three, at least four or five houses down. Yeah. Mm. Two, 219 must have called 230 and said, hey, he running your way. Yep. 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 Had to. Yep. Because how in the world they already in the truck with the guns and yeah, everything? Yeah. Bring it out. Okay, so, so you're saying they was waiting on him. They was waiting on him. Damn. Damn. That, that's what that's called what premeditated Pre murder. Premeditated murder. First degree murder, y'all. So so overalls came outside, called McMichaels, must have. Mm -hmm. and, and or his and wife or somebody yeah. called the goons. Cause that you know the pickup truck. You know, remember back in the day with a pickup truck? <laughs> yeah. All the meat mice on the back of that pickup truck. Woo. Woo. Be ready to fight. Yeah. And so how in the world 219 called 230? And they already in the truck. They're ready. Got guns already. Yep. Play the video. Probably drunk as hell. At 1.10 p.m., Travis and his father, Gregory, grab their guns, jump in a white truck, and leave the house to pursue Mr. Arbery. We don't have footage showing the next three minutes, but testimony Gregory McMichael gave police at the scene and interviews by another witness, Roddy Bryan, indicate what happened. Gregory and Travis McMichael follow Arbery onto Burford Road. Watch Their it. neighbor, Roddy Bryan, sees the pursuit, gets in his car, Pause and it. follows. Damn. Now, that, that orange truck right there, it was breaking news earlier today 
That's the one who filmed it. Yeah. They just locked him up. Yeah, he got to yeah. go. Yeah. They locked him up. They locked mm. his ass up. Now, because he he, now he's an he's an because he's an actual accessory to the crime. There yep. you go. You said because right this way. video shows it right, right. here. Right. Mm -hmm. He hopped in the trunk and started chasing him down. He's not filming for his friend's sake. He's hunting him down too. Exactly. Right. Right. To show his right. buddies. Play the video. So just like in those days when they used to have posters of us uh, being hanged. He was that cameraman. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, yeah. Oh, right. yeah. He right. was a what they call a postcard. Postcard man taking a picture. And at the end of the day, if if uh, ever, we all grew up in the hood, if you running away from somebody, if you just did some wrong, you ain't running down the middle of the street for however many Hell blocks. No. You exactly. running right. in and out of houses. Right. You jumping you fences. You. Going through houses, right. backyards. Bring it out. This dude ran for two miles down the middle of the road where the orange line's at. Yeah. Hey, play the video. Watch this. Play the video. We go The McMichaels down. try to cut Arbery off. Arbery doubles back and passes them. Brian tries to block Arbery, but Arbery runs there past him and toward Holmes Road. They Gregory McMichael climbs them. from the cab to the bed of the truck, armed with a handgun. We don't know exactly what happens next. But Brian and the McMichaels end up following Arbery on Holmes Road. And we next see Arbery at 1.14pm running back down Holmes Road, away from Roddy Bryan and towards the McMichaels. Roddy Bryan is filming and a warning, these scenes are distressing. There you go. Gregory McMichael dials 911 at this time. Lamentations. We're going we to end it on this one. Lamentations <laughs> 4... They and hunted that man down, y'all. You exactly right. In broad daylight, that's the, that's that's the thing about it. The pride of Esau is they in the broad don't... daylight with guns. Daylight. Tell us we ain't the Israelites. Tell us this Bible ain't Ooh, true. Your damn. ass is crazy. <laughs> Proof of it right there. Read that. Lamentations Lamentation. four eighteen. Lamentations chapter four and verse eighteen. Bring it out. They hunt our steps. That we cannot go in our streets. What did they do? They mm. hunted Ahmad Arbery down. Chased him down with two cars. He kept turning around in circles. He had nowhere to go. He's like a a a, a, a stuck hog or yeah, something in a pen, just nice. waiting on death. They hunt our steps. Read on. Our end is near. Our days are fulfilled. For our end is come. Uh huh. Our persecutors are swifter than the eagles of the heaven. The eagle is their symbol, and how are they swifter? They didn't chase him down on foot. Mm. They hopped in trucks, trucks. to chase him down. And Cap, swift like an eagle. Go ahead, and Cap, you, you know they wasn't trying to uh, be peaceful. Or they grabbed the guns. Right. They know he ain't got nothing on him. Right. right. He ain't got right. no guns on him. Right. Read verse 20. Verse 20. The breath of our nostrils. The breath of our nostrils is what? The anointed of the Lord. The breath of our nostrils is the anointed of the Lord. And what, did, what did he say back in First Chronicles? No, Touch not, not my anointed. anointed. Bring it out. So Esau got a judgment. There you can't go. save him. You, you better can, believe it. It don't matter how many kids you have with Becky it, it, or Johnny. It don't matter. Yeah. You cannot save them. Though hand join in hand, you cannot save the wicked. Man. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold, from Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone, 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how we're men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.